Hi guys, welcome to RPA stuff. And in today's video, we will look at the introduction of RPA. What are the benefits of RPA and what are the applications of RPA? So what is RPA? So RPA stands for Robotic Process Automation. And the high level definition is it's a software technology that mimics uh, human actions on a computer, provided that it is a rule based and a repetitive task. So why should we use RPA? Why should we use a bot instead of a human or a normal employee? So these are the reasons. The first one is high productivity. So as a human, we have certain limits. We cannot uh, work for 24 hours. We can just work for some eight to nine hours and we have to take regular breaks. But when it comes to bot, it can work for 24 seven and that increases the overall uh, productivity of the process. Second one is high accuracy. So when a human works, there is always possibilities of uh, possibilities of error, uh, human error. So when it comes to a bot, uh, it is always following the instructions which we have provided. So the accuracy is very high with uh, zero errors. The third one is data security. So some processes or some informations are very confidential and it cannot be shared uh, with everyone and uh, it should remain within limited number of people. So such kind of data can be processed through bots and this will ensure that less number of people uh, are aware of the data and it's highly secure. Next reason is bots are scalable. With increasing demand from business, we can increase the number of bots. So this avoids a business from hiring new temporary employees or giving extra salaries to the employees. So this benefits a lot. Next one is minimum upfront investment. So like I said, uh, for a employee, we have to spend in, we have to invest in its training. We have to give them salaries we have to give them bonus. And this, there's a cost associated with it. And if you compare it with the uh, RPA bots, it's uh, way less and cheaper options. So yeah, next reason is uh, create better service experience. So see if we see the overall output and uh, if we see the overall benefit, uh, the customer satisfaction, which is the goal of a business is achieved through RPA. So next question is what can a bot do? So these are the activities bot can do. It can log in into any application. It can copy paste data, maybe from a PDF file to Excel file or a text file. It can do it and it can move files and folders and it can create documents for you. It can extract uh, data like I said from a PDF document and enter it on the applications of your choice. Uh, it can also read and write data to a database. Uh, apart from it, that uh, bots can also read emails. Uh, they can identify the attachments. They can classify them. Uh, next one is the uh, extract data from website. So bots can actually go to the website, which we specified. It can extract all data. And uh, if it wants, it can just write it to a Excel file and mail it to you. Uh, apart from this, bot can also carry out some calculations like getting out average or uh, other uh, financial uh, calculations which we do. Uh, all of these things can be done by bot. So this is a sample bot and this bot will go to Google and it will search for weather in London and it will give me the current temperature in London. So this is a sample bot and uh, in few further videos, I will be showing how to create this. So let's just trigger it. It's like you said, it has launched Google and it's searching for weather in London and it has a uh, it has extracted the temperature and it, and it is showing it in a uh, message box. So 
So the most popular RPA tools are automation anywhere, UiPath, Blue Prism, Pega, Power Automate, Open RPA, Robocorp. And then this UiPath and Automation Anywhere are currently leading the RPA industry. Uh, in this tutorial series, I will be training you on Automation Anywhere A360. Mm. So why Automation Anywhere A360? Uh, what are the benefits? So it's a cloud-based platform and it's very easy to use. Uh, all the actions are available with us. We have to just drag and drop it. And due to which uh, very minimum amount of coding knowledge is required. There is no syntax to remember. Only a good logic building mind uh, can easily use this tool. And it has an active community. So this active community, we can always reach out to vast number of people and we can actually post a question on their community and uh, they will surely help you out. And the last reason it's, uh, it's demand is very high. So right now, like I said, uh, it's uh, leading in RPA, in RPA uh, field area. So people are looking out for uh, automation anywhere developers. So, uh, next lecture, we'll be looking at uh, how to register yourself on automation anywhere community edition uh, software or platform and uh, how to install bot agent and how to connect your device to the control room. Uh, so stay tuned and please like, share and subscribe and stay tuned for the new videos.